Hi, this is Chris Mitchell with CBN News here in Jerusalem. I'll be praying about the current situation here in Israel. And as I turn the camera around, Father, we can rejoice in the fact that the prophet Zechariah said thousands of years ago that children would be playing in the streets and in the parks here in Jerusalem. And we see that with our very eyes. And Father, also that we see that you instituted the Feast of Tabernacles. And in this neighborhood in Jerusalem, we can see the evidence it being celebrated thousands of years after you first commanded the Israelites, the Jewish people, to celebrate the Feast of Tabernacles. And we see the booths. We thank you for your faithfulness throughout the millennia for the Jewish people. And here we are in 2020. The Jewish people are back in the land of Israel, back in the city of Jerusalem. And we rejoice in that. But Father, we also know that right now Israel is in the midst of a lockdown because of the coronavirus pandemic. So we pray, Father, that you would give wisdom and understanding to the leaders of Israel to get Israel through this crisis. We pray for those that have been afflicted by it physically, that you would raise them up. We pray for those who have lost loved ones, that you would comfort them. And for those that have been afflicted financially, emotionally, mentally, economically, that you would give them hope, that you would restore lives and livelihoods during this crisis. And Father, we also know during this lockdown, Israel is also surrounded by its enemies, Iran, Hezbollah, Hamas. So we pray, as, as it says in Psalm 121, that he that watches over Israel will neither slumber nor sleep. So we pray that you continue to watch over Israel. And Father, we just as well know that when the coronavirus pandemic will subside, there is foretold and expected a dramatic increase of Aliyah, the Jewish people returning to the land of Israel. We pray, Father, that you would accelerate that and yet you would continue to fulfill what the Hebrew prophet said would happen thousands of years ago. The Jewish people would continue to come back here to the promised land for such a time as this. So we ask for the peace of Jerusalem. We pray for the peace of Jerusalem and for your wisdom upon the leaders and your blessing upon the land of Israel for such a time as this. In Jesus' name, amen.